Hi guys, Assalamualaikum. So firstly, before I start, I just want to mention the background noise. It's because I switch on my aircon because it gets too warm in here. But today I'm just going to do a little bit of haul that I went on, um, I think last two weeks ago in Mood Republic Festival in Johor Bahru. I just want to mention that I did film this video before this. So some of the um, shawls are already taken out from the bag. But um, the videos got deleted so because my laptop broke down, so I had to refilm it. So let's dig out from this bag. This time around, they have more vendors. They have more than 100 vendors. But I was interested in the clothes because a lot of it was jubas and I wasn't looking for jubas. So I got myself shawls. Um, not a lot too. I feel that even though there's a lot of vendors, it was more costly this time around. So yeah, let's get started. You all think I'm like close to the camera. <laughs> I want to be close to the camera because I know that my voice would be quite far because of the noise but I hope I'm not like too close to you all. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, anyway, let's get started. Um, okay, the first stall that I went to was Turong People. They do have Turong People um, in Singapore. No, no, not in Singapore. They have Turong People SG in our Instagram but I've never bought it before. So um, yeah, I went to this stall and I got to meet Fazrina Aziz. I'm going to put the picture over here. I was awkward. <laughs> She's so beautiful in person. I, I really like talking to her. So anyway, um, this is the shawl that I got. It is just a normal cream shawl. I did um, use this shawl already because it's been two weeks. So I used this shawl um, on Hari Raya Haji. I'm going to post the video up. Uh, uh, no, the video. I'm going to post the picture right now. I really like um, the material. This reminds me of a dark scarf. I've never owned any dark scarf before but it is the same material. It's a cotton crepe material. So um, this one is the newest collection that they have for Turong people. So they didn't actually reduce the price on that day. It was just launched on that day but it cost 63 ringgit or 69 ringgit. My neighbors need to keep quiet. <laughs> Sorry, so much noise, but yeah, this is called the Hawa scarf and the color or the shade is called Donut. So I really like it. I feel that it's very lightweight and it's easy to wear. It falls on your face, so it's, it's really good. It's really nice. And then I went to this store where they sell like four shawls for 100 RM. So these ones are all chiffon georgette shawls. I like chiffon georgettes because, um, like I said, I don't like chiffon shawls because it's it gets very slippery. And um, you know when like you take voodoo and stuff, it will get like all the wet patches. I don't like that. But I like chiffon georgette because it is slightly of a rougher material, so it wouldn't slip out. It's easier to style, and yeah, it falls nicer. So I got um this for I'll just show you one by one um, they are from the store called Benang Hijau I'm gonna find if they have a online store that I'll just put the link in the below in the brown box below but I have this one which is in purple floral I have this one which I've worn it in my previous video um, it's just a blue floral shawl I really like it and then um, I have another neutral color um, this one is something like a beige yeah something like a beige because I don't have like pa I like pastel colors but I don't have like this kind of soft colors in my shawl collections and then lastly I have this one my mom actually likes this print so I think I'm going to give this to her but yeah I, I think it's really pretty too and then um, I went to this store called Jalita Sara yeah Jalita Sara and they were selling this shawls that have the lacing yep okay so basically i know that it is not new this lacing thing is not new but i don't own one so i just decided why not get some but this color is um, for my mom um, it just has a blue and um, chocolate with it and mine is in pink and a hint of gold lacing if you guys watched my previous video i did style my this style using this so this is how uh, this is where I got it from Jalita Sara and it cost two for 150 ringgit which to me is quite expensive because one cost 75 ringgit but I don't know if you change it to our money then it'll be worth it but of course if you guys are Malaysians then I don't think that it's um, cheap oh this one is in chiffon materials and then um, 
let me just go to this one first. Okay, then I went to this store, um, this booth called Osha Scarf, O-S-H-A. They actually were selling this, this shawls, it's a chiffon shawl, normal chiffon shawl, and then they have like these beadings to it. Yeah, and then I saw like in the posters, the people were using this and were styling it um, where they have like this uh, bits on their side of their head, some of them have it on top of their head, some of them just leave it dangling. So I just thought that it would be nice to have one of these. I just pick out a staple colour so I can do anything with it. But it was expensive so I only got myself one and I felt that it, I don't know why it, why it costs so much. If it's just because of the bidding then that's very very expensive. Um, this one, one of it costs um, Oh shucks, I forgot how much it cost. Okay, I'm going to find it out, but I know it was expensive, but I'm going to find it out and I'm going to uh, put in the link down below. But yeah, I got this one from Osha Scarf. I think it's pretty, I just don't think that it's, it should be priced at a high price. So this one, this is a normal plain chiffon shawl. Then I, uh, within the booth, they also have another one more. Um, company which is called Binalin. I'm not very sure whether they come from the same company but um, they were selling satin shawls and I love myself some satin shawls. I got um, this one in dark red maroon and then I of course have to have a cream colored shawl. The last one I have is this one it's in a dark purple quite close to a chocolate so it's like a brown purple color yeah, I thought it was a very nice colour, um, nice exclusive colour. So um, this one is very very soft so I really, really like it. Um, I have this kind of shawl, this is called the Dull Satin Shawl. Um, I have this kind of shawl and I did do some videos on it. Um, it is the Side Fringe tutorial so if you guys want to watch, you can watch that video. Lastly, it comes to this. I have something to tell you guys. This is an instant shawl and I... <laughs> the last time I did a haul tutorial, a Okay, so I'm hoping that my neighbor would keep quiet for a while. Yeah, I was talking about my instant shawl. Um, in my previous video, haul video that I did from Vendor Festival, I did went to get Nilofa instant shawls and I said I was going to do a video on it or a tutorial on it. But then I realized that I don't look good in it or like it doesn't suit my face really well. I didn't really like instant shawls. I prefer if it's semi-instant or I prefer if it's just a normal shawl so I can do a lot of styles with it. So I didn't get around to that video and then I bought some more shawls, instant shawls. I fell in love with this one so I got this one. But this one is not an instant shawl. This one is a semi-instant shawl and they have it in different material. This one I got, um, the shop is called Iras. It was selling for 2 for 130 ringgit. Um, this one, the material the material is in satin. Um, similar to this one that I got. It's a dull satin shawl. I bought it in like a greyish colour because I will always love my grey shawls. <laughs> so I have this one and this one is in a chiffon material. This is a dull pink colour. Okay, so I'm just going to show you guys how it looks and um, how you use it. So I'm just going to put this into my head. Okay, so they have like two bits over here. So what you want to do is just twist it and bring this bit right close to your eyebrow area. So it should go somewhere like that. And flip. And then you just have to pin this over here and then just adjust the sides um, to whatever length you want at the front and that's it and then just take the left over and then just pin it to this shoulder I really like it because I feel that this is very stylish but at the same time it's so easy to do it just takes me a few seconds to just put it on so that is why I got it and I feel that because it's a semi instant shawl I can still adjust this um, the cheeks areas but it wouldn't look too weird so yeah that's the reason why I got it and I'm very sorry about the Nilofa shawls if you guys still really want me to do it I'll try to do it but it's just that it just doesn't fit my, my my face well and instant shawls just doesn't look that good on me but I prefer semi instant shawls so yeah that is all that I have for you but I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you guys soon bye